actually bumped into him one night in a bar having a beer and he was taking a telephone call from somebody and I said to him after the call, who was that? And he said, it's my wife, she's in prison. And I said, wow. And uh, he said, you know, you want to make a film in Syria that's truthful? You want to come and film me? So that's how it started. I love her more than anyone can love anybody. He cannot find anybody understand him like him. I was so inside the family, I was then filming everything, really. I mean, Amma said in one of the questions and answers that he took part in that he sometimes imagines I'm filming in his dreams <laughs> because the camera's been so present inside their life all the time. But it had become an invisible, an invisible tool, really. I was just there witnessing everything. Watching a film like this and having the privilege of living with Bob since he was three until he was eight, seeing him grow up in all of those different situations. Hopefully, when you look at refugees on the news, you'll think of this family and actually realize that all of those refugees are human beings too.